I do not want to hear this talk from you again. Doubt is heavier than a week snow. Forgive me, my chieftain. We will be ready for the next attempt. But this will not be an attempt. It must be done. Do you understand? My chieftain. Good. Outlander, I suppose you wish to speak? You're set on going back to the mountain? I put my word to it. Even with the risks being so great? The risk of what? Death? It would be a worse fate to bow our heads to the challenge and say too much. Did your Warwick come from this place? No, he rallied most of our hunters from across Banyor to face the threat of the demon. But I was born here and stayed to fight the Karja when others retreated into the mountains. A few of my old warriors remain with me, those who survived. This demon you talked about. If you are hardy enough, you can venture out and see the signs yourself. It has changed the machines, made them fiercer, stronger. But what is it? A matter for the shamans to debate. There are other Warax in Song's Edge, too? Yes. The village has its own life, for all Banuku need trade or shelter. After the war ended, it sprang up from what was once a campsite, quick as the bloom between frosts. Perhaps it will last, until the Karja seek war again. Orea knows about this, Daemon. Where would I talk to her? She does a shaman's work. That is not for the eyes and ears of others. Certainly not an Outlander's. Well, I guess that's it then. Good. I prefer deeds to words. Right. This is a demon ghost. Demon will have no chance of fighting. 